there, I'm Georgia and I'm in Dubai on a quick stopover. I'm going to see how much I can cram into the day and we're starting with the Museum of the Future. So this space is called Today Tomorrow. Look, this is my new mate. This is Emika. Hello, Emika. Hello, human. Salam alaikum. Welcome to the Museum of the Future. <laughs> You have this little scanner and you can use it on the vials and it will show you information about different species. So all of these shapes are actually Arabic calligraphy that are quotes about the future written by the Sheikh. Well that was absolutely insane. I've never seen anything like it. Let's head over to the Arabian Tea House. So I'm in the Arabian Tea House in Al Fahidi. This is such a cool place. I've never been to anything like it. Um, there's pebbles on the floor in a restaurant and leaves on the ceiling. I don't know whether I'm inside or outside. I can't wait to dig into this amazing food. Now we're gonna have a little walk around Al Sif, which is a neighborhood in Old Dubai. So these buildings are modeled off what it used to look like back in the day. It kind of feels like I've traveled back in time. over there this morning. I'm just having a little recharge right now and then I'm going to head to Al Sakal to check out a bit of art. I'm just going to stay here a bit longer. cool area but you have to dig a little bit to find the gems. I've heard there's a really cool coffee place over there so let's go have a look. Welcome to the Tandur Tina. I'm Chef Jay, head of the restaurant. So here I got you a few dishes. So here I have peel and barley salad. Here we have charred aubergine with tomato chutney and yogurt china sauce. It will go very well with butter naan. Awesome, thank you. I believe you will enjoy. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks. I've just had an amazing dinner downstairs and I've come upstairs to the monkey bar for a drink. Honestly, I didn't know what to expect traveling alone as a woman in Dubai, but it's just been an amazing experience and I've just had the best time traveling alone and I would do it again in a heartbeat.